Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Yuri the Incredible, Incredible, Incredible. What is going on, everybody? Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Yuri the Incredible, always representing that incredible apparel. And this is day two of what did I name the series? What did I name in them? What did I name it? Um, chasing for my pro card, right? Really incredible chasing for my pro card. Done two competition I've given myself from now, from this year, this is 2021, two years. So this year and next year, but 2022, if I'm, I don't know if I should say this, we'll see, that it's subject to change. By 2022, end of 2022, if I'm not making it, then um, I don't know if I want to chase it. It's, I love competing, don't get me wrong. It's good to compete and all of that stuff, but it's it's beat up your body, right? It's beat it up. Like for anybody that has done it, it's the most satisfying and the hardest thing that you'll ever do. As you guys saw the scale on, on last episode, we can came around, I indulged, but I ate a little bit. And then obviously my weight went back up to starting off at 114 this week. I uh, finished my oat, I got my egg whites, so basically I had uh, six whites and two eggs, so I'm just going to devour this and then start off my day. And the plan is um, work my weak points out, weaknesses right now, I think my hamstrings need to get a little bit better, I need to come in a little bit tighter, my lats need to work on that, basically everything, right? Let's see what happens when it comes to this, um, there's no shortage here. Of hard work. That's one thing that I always say. No shortage of hard work. A freaking workhorse. For somebody that's starting a diet, look what my passenger seats. Look at that. Look, 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 look. So sour worms or gummy sweet or sour sweet, whatever you guys call it. Yeah, sour gums galore. So that's what I got. I've got a sweet tooth. So what I do is I usually have like a couple in my plastic and I put it in my, my fanny pack, right? So when the workout goes mad, mad, goes hard, right? So I just cut a few of them. I call them my sensu bean. You just get a little bit of carbs or sugar and then I'm back at it. But obviously I'm gonna start moving them from life and it's gonna suck. But we gotta do what we gotta do if we wanna get that pro card, right? Started working on this particular gym, but whenever it came to my prep, I trained somewhere else. So I'm gonna just stick to where it all began and prep my ass off and see where it leads. So let's go get it. We stayed on the second day, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do uh, chase. Everybody loves chase, right? So I got, um, got somebody to record me. Let's get it. I'm not gonna show you everything, but as you guys can kind of figure out what happens is that I started with warm-up, just did as long well. as many reps that I could to get the blood in with the one plate on. And then I went to two plates, then I got to my working set. I did a set of those. So right now what I'm doing is pyramiding down. Went up, now I'm going down. So just pumping a lot of blood into the chest area and Started with the incline press because a lot of people, this is the lagging part, the upper shaft of your chest. So we started with that so that we're not tired when it comes to this. So the hardest part or the hardest exercise, I'd advise you to do it first so that you don't leave it out because it's going to be hard and then you'll be lazy to do it. You don't want that. And next exercise, exercise is the big thing that I like to set my, my workout out on my triceps by getting fatigued so I come to the pick deck so I have a little bit of a rest on my triceps so that I, whenever I go to push again I'm able to to load it up deck I'm gonna do four sets four sets of nothing less than 12 reps so 12 to 15 reps Use the incline. This is one of my 
weakest lift. This is a two two plates on each side. I'm gonna go for one more one more set. I'm doing four sets. One more set. Try and go for three plates if I can, or two and a half. Let's get it done. One of the machines that a lot of people do not use or neglect is a dip machine. You guys can see I'm finishing off with the table accessory work and next time I do chest I'm gonna probably do the weight meaning like dumbbells and stuff like that so this time was like machines and barbells and all of that so next time I'm gonna do with the dumbbells straight up dumbbells nothing else just refining and accessory work whenever it comes to pulleys so that's exactly what we want to do we want to cross out all the I's and dot out all the cross out all the T's and dot out all the I's that's what I'm trying to say. If you listen to my, you follow my channel, and obviously you watch the intro, and it says, allow me to reintroduce myself. The reason why I have that, everything that I'm doing has a reason, right? The reason why I have that is because a lot of people don't know who I am. A lot of people, like even in the, in the bodybuilding community over here, the amateur circuit, a lot of people don't know who I am. Still, after winning, they're still doubting me. Eventually, you will get to know me. You will know who I am. And I uh, definitely am incredible. So this is the less glamorous side of the whole training. I'm watching a documentary over here. The reason why I have that is so that I don't see the time because it's messes with my head if I'm like training for like, I'm working for like two minutes and I'm thinking I'm working for like 15 minutes. So I cover the thing with my towel and I watch and I watch something and then I know when that thing is done. When that thing is done, then I'm done. Here we go. My cardio session done. I'm gonna show you my numbers. That calories, 587, 45 minutes. Obviously it's not that accurate, but it gives me, it gives me the benchmark to step it up and all of that good, good. Cardio for me has become therapeutic in the sense that every step that I take, I'm getting pissed off. Probably wondering why are you getting pissed off? What I do is I watch documentaries of all kinds of sports. What I was watching right now is a documentary about Tariq Hill, right? For those of you that don't know who he is, he's an American football player. And before that, I watched a documentary about Israel at the Sinai. I'm actually studying their mind and if I get so pissed off always saying my telling myself that I'm the hardest worker in the room so every step that I take I'm getting closer and closer 
and closer. The story while I was telling you that I'm, I'm watching the documentary is only because studying the mind and seeing how hard they work to become great at their craft, right? So right now, I'm working so hard to be great in my craft and I'm getting upset, I'm getting angry, I'm getting annoyed because I don't think that people respect me enough in this game. I guess you gotta earn respect. I've done two shows and I've won two of my shows. Maybe that doesn't, it doesn't earn the respect of anybody, but it's just annoying me because I know how hard I've worked to get to where I am. A lot of people start competing when they're young. I started when I was older and I've got a chip on my shoulder to actually, actually prove everybody wrong and to prove myself right. And that being said, the mind of these athletes are amazing. And I'm tapping into that, into that warrior spirit. And every time I say that I'm incredible, that's not just to brag, it's not just to do anything. Is I'm actually pulling that energy in and I start believing it. So like every step that I'm taking, I'm believing that I'm incredible. So there's people that want to come at me. Like Israel Adesanya said, people that want to come at me, you better come at me yesterday. Because every day, I'm getting better. With the work that I'm putting in, Get out of here, man. Get out of here. It's gonna be hard to beat me. Now, I'm not saying that I'm gonna be a pro this year, but it's in the cards. It's in the stars. Well, I mean, the, there's no stars right here, but it's in the stars. You can't stop me. You can, cannot stop me. That being said, if you like this video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Watch my journey. I will become a pro. I will not disappoint you. And if I don't, I'm sure as hell going down with a fight. With that being said, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. You are who you say you are, and I'm incredible. You're the incredible guy. Peace. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Yuri the Incredible, 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 Incredible.